Hi, I'm Cassandra DeCordo with the Fiercely Independent Network. We're here at the Bearsville Theater for a screening of Marathon, The Patriots Day Bombing. Uh, my reaction uh, towards being in the film, I was all for it. Um, I'm very much an advocate for getting the stories out there and just uh, letting people know what happened. Well, um, Woodstock has been great. Uh, the reaction has been all positive. Um, I'm actually really uh, just humbled by everyone's reaction because so many people have just been so, so kind. I don't think there's been a dry eye or a nose for that matter in the theaters and everyone is just so, so sweet when they come up and so honest. Believe, we first heard about it through our friend uh, uh, John Tamaki from the Boston Globe and he had told us about it and what the concept was and stuff and we had done interviews and everything and I thought that this was so uh, a story that needed to be told um, people needed to see how horrific uh, what happened was and just talking to people just telling people what happened there's no way that you can get the impact um, and the, the reality of it until you see those images, those pictures. This is our second screening at Woodstock, and um, you know, as I said when I introduced the film, like the uh, the Woodstock audience is an amazing audience. They're just a smart, you know, emotionally invested audience, and so to show a film here is. Um, kind of a gift to filmmakers. Uh, the audience, they all stayed around and you know the what their comments to the people in, in the film, in this case, you know it being about the marathon, the Boston Marathon bombing, it's 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 the live experience that you can't duplicate when you show the film. It's going to be on HBO. and and that give and take, hearing from an audience, having a chance to ask a question, having the subjects in the film have a chance to answer that question. As a filmmaker, I could have been there all night listening because that's what you're, that you, when you're making the film, you, you hope that people are getting, you know, what you're bringing to it, the emotion you're bringing to it, the narrative you're bringing to it, and, and that people are responding to it in a way that, um, as you're sitting in your little edit room for months after months after months with your editor and, you know, in a bubble, you know, to show it to a live audience is incredibly rewarding, uh, especially when they, you know, react the way they did tonight. For more from the Independent Network and to learn more about the festival, please visit www.woodstockfilmfestival.com.